Some things are great when they're 50. Some things are great when you're about 17 or 18. Our guest here today, this is his 50th birthday party, but you're going to see him back in 1991 when you were what, 17? 17. 17. Sir, if you would, introduce yourself. Chris Goss, 1991, Kentucky State Champion it's from Sheldon Clark High School. And we have made reference to this video in other videos. We've, we've said that it's a myth that you won. Maybe you did, maybe you didn't. There's no video proof of it. Um, I, I know I've said it in Bruce Stepp's video, Reese's video, that, like I said, maybe you did, maybe you didn't. But now we have the definitive uh, proof that you won. I'm still questioning the validity of Chris Goss's 160-pound 1991. They said he won it. Chris, you got to prove it. And some guy that, I don't know how he, how he done it, but some guy named Chris Goss won the state championship at 160 pounds, Chris. You have made an appearance in the 1990 video against Kurt Zinga. Yes. 160 pounds, 1990. And you come up a little bit short. You're a junior, but you gained a valuable... Valuable experience. Yes. Kurt, great wrestler, great video. Um, what do you think changed about your wrestling from a junior to a senior? Um, during that summer, I attended the uh, University of Iowa's wrestling camp. Okay. For about a month and a half, I went on to wrestle in the junior nationals All right. with uh, Kevin Dresser, who's now the head coach at Iowa State. Okay. He, so he coaches uh, Carr, David Carr. Yes. Okay, that's what I thought. And David Carr's video is on the channel, by the way. Now... We're going to go over your bracket here real quick. 160 pounds. The first round, you wrestle Don Scrant from Western, I believe, mm -hmm. and you win that by a fall. Yes. You go on to the uh, quarters, you're wrestling Hughes. I believe his name is Ramon Hughes from North Harden. You win that by a 7-0 decision. Yes. Remember that? Then the match that has so much lore about it, I think it's talked more about that than your finals, is your semifinals. Right. You're wrestling Barrett, uh, was it Mark Barrett Mark from Barrett. Campbell County. You win that by a 3-2 to two decision in overtime. I think you were tied 5-5 going into the overtime, and you win a 3-2 overtime. And in case you don't know, in case you're new to the sport, back in 1991, you got three one-minute periods, correct? Yes. And he doesn't know this. I would save this for the video, but we actually have that full video. We have that full video, and we're going to save it for the end of the video. We'll put it in at the end. We also have your quarters against Hughes and your regional finals. So we have four videos of you wrestling. Those three will be at the end of the video. We're not going to do their commentary for that. Now, if you can't tell, we got a big crowd behind us, a lot of people here. It's your surprise 50th birthday party. Uh, and I thought, what a what a better time than to surprise you with this with this video. So it's been a, a day or two since you've seen this, correct? Oh, it's it's been several years. And has any of your kids seen you wrestle before this video that you know of? Not that I know of. Okay. So uh, Reese, you know, 2022 state champion now wrestling at University of Pikeville. Uh, Reagan. Great athlete in her own, from what we've been told to store stories about her. So, but it's it's dad's turn. The uh, one of my favorite lines of the whole series is George King. He said, "Maybe not now, but at one time, dad could do it." And we're getting ready to watch dad do it. So let's go back to Atherton. <coughs> now, this video that you're seeing, the quality that we have of the match is ten times better. This come from Richard Brown's mother who passed away from Trinity. So you gotta be nervous right here. It's your second time in the finals, knowing you can be Sheldon Clark's first state champ. Here we go. Keep on going down. So you're in the red singlet, Colin shoots in, you go out, go out of bounds. Nothing there, nothing there. Hustle back to the center. You're a beast for 160. Are you sure you weigh 160 pounds here? During the week I weigh. Okay, I was going to say. Hulk Hogan walking around out there. So what's your go-to takedown, Chris? What, what are we looking to do here? It was always an inside sweep that uh, Coach Magnet taught me. Right. A little bit of a glitch in the tape, but you get a takedown. 
And thank you to Arthur Preston, by the way, for getting us this video. It's so great that he was able to find these. So you're riding him, you're riding him. Looking for a tilt. That was, I was uh, going to say, that's a Jim Matney staple. Right, a yeah, tilt series or a cradle. I mean, that's what's... Yeah, whenever I was on top, that's, that's what I was looking for. Just a, just a simple little tilt right there. Is that a bow and arrow? No. And that's, you hear Arthur's dad, and this was the time that Arthur said this was the first wrestling meet that his dad ever got to attend was the state finals on 1991. Arthur had a good state tournament that yeah, year. Yeah, he, he got third, I believe, correct? Yeah, third. So what are we trying to do here, Chris? What we, end keep, of the period? Yeah, it's towards the end of the period. Just kind of keep pressure on. Don't let him score no points. Kind of keeping on the edge of the match. Right. Uh, I guess you could say, you know, I'm up with a takedown. Just trying to burn that last few seconds of the period. So he deferred. You're taking down. I'm coming straight up. It should be a stand-up, or back then I could hit a little Gramby. Okay. Or a shrug. Could you wrestle six minutes today, you think? No. I'm, ki I'm kidding. I'm no. kidding. So there you go. Hit like a Peterson. Tried to hit a Peterson. Tried a little Peterson. I don't think the ref gave any change of reversal there or change of control. He got almost a Blair ride on you. That's what I said. <laughs> yeah. He's trying to Blair ride. He didn't know what he was doing, but he had a Blair ride. Oh, what? Kind of went to my back for a second. Whenever I saw that, I was like, what's he doing? I know he wins at 10 nothing, but what is he doing? Ooh. Ooh. Nope. Nothing. Uh. You know, he had almost beat me earlier in the year, like three weeks prior to the state tournament. Yeah. 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 If you see me giving referee signals, guys, it's just a habit. All right, so you're trying for some hand control. Yeah, coming up. Come up. I'm going to hips out. There you go. You get your one. I'm going to get my two here. I don't think I got max. So there you get. So I've got it at five nothing now. You get a takedown and escape and a take and a takedown. Yes. So five nothing. You remember hearing the crowd, hearing Coach Matney, anybody? Don't. About the only person I can remember was my grandmother. Okay. <laughs> I, I could hear her. I could hear her voice. Yeah. You know, she wasn't able to attend a lot of the tournaments. Right. But the ones that she did attend, I, I can just uh, remember her screaming, "Go, Chris!" Yeah. I can. I can believe that, man. Wrestling grandmas can be something. So on top, you've kind of run like a tilt series. What are we looking to do here? You know, you're up five points. What? Just, just staying in control. Mm -hmm. You know. As coach will say, don't do nothing stupid. Yeah. So that's pretty much, you know, just kind of make sure I stay in a good position. Trying for a nice little trip there. You get it. Capturing the arm right there. Capturing. Like I said here, I'm trying to pull the wrist under. Going back to my tilt series right here on the edge. Yeah. We're out. We're out of bounds. Now, you had just wrestled. A full match, nine minutes, yes. and then three. Yeah. So nine minutes, and you were just absolutely dead. Was your energy level here? I mean, are we? Is yeah, adrenaline I, took over? I, what what we did. doing? I, I remember trying to warm up about an hour and a half before yeah. my match. Yeah. Coach just telling me, you know, just sit down and relax. Mm -hmm. There it is, another tilt series. Up, up, up. The referee's getting some swaps there. Looks like you got give it three, three counts, so it's eight nothing now. Wasn't really in control. Going back forward again. Up oh, one, two. So, oh, ooh, nothing there. Ooh, I don't know. I don't know about that, Mr. Official. So he's going to take down. You can tell you're upset. You didn't get that yeah. count right there. And that's the all-time uh, stall move. Time to shoe, but now that would be a that'd be a stall. I think coach right there was you see me look at coach, he's uh -huh. telling me I'm just stay in control. You were a little big, weren't you? 
<laughs> was it a two day weigh in? Yeah. Or was it just a one day and then be done with it? I think it was a two day, Alex. Okay, that's fine. So knowing you, he he took down, and you've rode him the whole the whole second period just about. Right. For a lift. He was a tall wrestler. Yeah. Really? That's what he did. Yeah. Yep, trying for a switch, you're not having any of it. I like to look on the edge of the mat right yeah. there in case you get in trouble. Yep. You can always just circle out. Still working, you know, working the one on one. All right, so I think he hit you for stalling right there. Might have. I think that's what the call was. So you got a stall on top, which that's your first of the my first one, yeah. on the first of the Did you guys see something the last time you wrestled him to load on that opposite side? Just, you know, working, you know, if he came up, I like I like controlling the angles. Coach and I worked on that. Right. Um, getting to the big angle, um, grabbing an ankle. Right. And just kind of, you know, kind of like a spiral ankle, right? Mm -hmm. You know, if I saw myself getting in trouble. So you can tell Coach is giving you. Oh, yeah. Oh, the referee was pointing stomach, so you must have come too far across or something. Now, what was the score that last time you all wrestled? He had, he was up, I believe, Four to five to one, I believe. The week before districts, and um, I caught him on his back the last period, last few seconds. There it is. There it is. Nope. Nope. Ooh. Nothing. He f that was a good fight, him right there. Good fight. Good fight. Save that ankle right there. And at the time, Atherton's clock was above the mat with the time score and everything, so you didn't have the luxury of looking up. Are, are you on E, adrenaline? Uh, yeah, pretty much. You know, I've got a good, comfortable lead right now. I don't want to do anything to jeopardize that. And there for the half, he's able to look away right there. Looking for the you know, two on one, one on right. one, trying to pull something in. Yeah. No, I think there's just a few seconds left yep. right here. I know the time right here is, you know, getting low. Yeah. One. And that was it. That was it. So with that, there you are getting your your teammates and shape. Yay! And, and with that, man, you become Sheldon Clark's first state champion. Uh, they have 19, well, Sheldon Clark and Mark County have 19 total, two team state championships. A lot of good wrestlers. A lot of good wrestlers come out of Martin County. So watching it back all these years, does it play out the way you remember it? Yeah, you know, some things that I forgot, yeah. you know, but for the most part, yeah. And it, it was, um, like I said, I mean, we've made reference to this video several times and we've tried to find it, but Arthur was able to find it for us. And thank you again to Arthur and to Dylan for meeting up with me and getting it. And, and I hope you, uh, hope you enjoyed it. Hope your family enjoyed thank watching you. it. And it's, it's cool. Uh, one of the uh, doing videos like this, the memorial videos, people that's passed away. It's one of the, uh, something I didn't see coming when I started the series after Coach Manny passed away, just how much it would mean to people oh, for situations like this. And, uh, and I don't think that's probably the first time my daughter. Yeah, yeah, that's, is, uh, and actually, wrestling. I've got the uh, thumb drive here in my pocket that I'm gonna give you. It's got all your, so there it is. Oh, thank you. There's thank your thumb you. drive. You've got it, got it forever, and now it'll be on the channel forever. But, man, any, uh, any closing words?
Thank you, Alex, for what you did. Uh, no problem, man. I'm glad I was able to come down here today and do it. Surprise 50th birthday party. So uh, that's all we got from this. Uh, I don't want to use the term nifty 50 birthday party, but that's all we got. We'll see you guys on the mats.
Chris.
feeling on that one. Get out, Chris! Thank 
Chris, hold it, Chris. Don't let him take you down. Hold him, Chris, hold him. Hold him. 